In the heart of affluent Silicon Valley, home to many tech giants like Google and Facebook, and just a block away from million dollar homes, a Palo Alto community is facing an uncertain future. Buena Vista, the city's only trailer park and home to more than 400 residents, may be shut down soon. Its owners decided three years ago to get the city's approval to close the park so that they could redevelop or sell the land. The current value of the four and a half acre property could be $55 million, real estate agents estimate, and the owners say developers have expressed interest in buying the park. A shutdown would have tremendous implications for the community's predominantly Hispanic residents. Many, such as Rene Escalante, moved here years ago attracted by cheap rents, a safe neighborhood, and reputable local schools. Mr. Escalante attributes his success as a parent to living in Buena Vista because his children have gotten a good education. Of course, we, we have stress, nervous, because, you know, it's, for us it's very hard to move to another places because more expensive, more danger, more, a lot of things, not good. Residents describe the park as a family-oriented place with a strong sense of community. If it is torn down, many would have to move so far away, they would also have to change jobs and schools. Some, such as Maria Martinez, worry about their families being broken up. You may find it affordable in a place that is not safe and maybe you can get people into bad neighborhoods like uh, gangs and that. And this is what, what we, we don't have over here. I mean, this means everything for us. This is our homes, this is our place to live. Ms. Martinez is one of the residents who has tried to raise awareness in Palo Alto about the threat to the trailer park. Neighbors from outside the park have helped as well. Winter Dellenbach is one of them. She has been organizing community events and trying to find resources to prevent the closure. This is a little village within a neighborhood, within a town, and we're all connected and we're not expendable. For Palo Alto to lose Buena Vista would be a tremendous blow to our civic pride, to how we see ourselves. Palo Alto sees itself as a town of smart people, a town of educated people of people that have good values and a good sense of community. The city of Palo Alto and Santa Clara County have raised $39 million so far in an effort to save the park. They are trying to raise more money from local individuals and corporations. If Buena Vista's owners choose their bid, the city and county would partner with a nonprofit organization, which would run the park. The trailer park residents would get to stay in their homes. Now it's up to the owners, San Jose resident Joe Gisser and his parents, to decide. Mr. Gisser says he is weighing whether he has a moral obligation to preserve housing for his low-income tenants, even if it means not accepting the highest bid. I understand that he wants to have the, the, the more money that he can. I understand, but I'm on the other side. So as he has the right to sell, we have the right to fight to stay. <laughs>